Hey everyone, Ryan from the Grumpy Old Gamers here. Uh, just wanted to share um, my retro pick for this week. Uh, you ever fall down those rabbit holes where, um, you know, instead of talking over the music, I'll just do this. You ever fall down those rabbit holes where you think of an old game that, that you just used to love playing? And for some reason, I, I remember renting this game a lot. And this is back when, you know, late 80s, early 90s, when every, you know, every uh, brand wanted to have a character associated with it. So this was the Domino's Pizza. Domino's? Yeah, it must have been Domino's. I don't think it was Pizza Hut. It was his, uh, uh, it was their character, and he was the Noid, because, you know, you don't want to be annoyed that your pizza's late. And um, the only reason I ever rented this is because it was a Capcom game. Capcom made this game, the Yo Noid, <laughs> for, for the NES. And uh, I just remember renting it a lot. And I haven't played it in years, so I looked up a copy on eBay there and, uh, and picked it up. And I'm going to give her a try here and see if it's uh, everything I remember. <laughs> okay, let's... Uh... Yeah, oh yeah, it is Domino's. There it is. Domino's Pizza. 1990. All right. Okay, that's so annoyed has a yo-yo for some reason, but for some reason my jump and shoot seem backwards, but that's fine. I'll just get used to it. I don't know what I'm collecting here. I don't know why there's guys with harpoons. Oh. Okay, that fish got me right off the bat. <laughs> okay. Can it, where does this, does this change? Oh yeah, okay, so I think it's just score. Pretty standard stuff here so far. You know, I was obsessed with renting uh, Capcom games. Oh, look at that. Oh! Stupid fish. Wow. Man, you forget how, how unforgiving so many of these games were back then. You know, there's another... I can't remember if it's for NES or for... Uh, um, no, it's for NES. So there's this, um, 7-Up used to have, um, uh, a spokesperson too, and it was the 7-Up spot, the red spot, and, um, I used to rent that a lot too, and it was basically, I found out as I got older, it's basically Othello. You play a game of Othello with this animated, uh, 7-Up spot. So, yeah, man, gotta love the 90s. Okay. Watch out for that stupid fish. Watch out for the water, I imagine, too. Ooh. Oh. Not cool. Not cool at all. That's fine. Oh, a limited number of continues as well. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's probably why I kept renting this. Got these controls down pat again. Oh, I just I think I could go back and get that. All right.
Oh, come on. All right. Oh, I can get that fish. Oh, I got an exclamation point. Welcome to the pizza eating club. <laughs> What is this? Am I just trying to pick a better... Um... Got two. I, I really don't know what's going on here. Like, I see what he's. Okay, this is crazy. Should I pick a one sometimes to. <laughs> oh man, like Do I let him win sometimes? Like I do not remember this at all in the game. Oh, he won two! Oh, because there was... Am I trying to... Look at that! Okay. I think I just always have to try and get more than him. I still win? Whoa, I... 
I have no recollection of that happening in this game. See, this is a, this is a level I remember. Oh, oh, it's icy. Classic Capcom stuff. Oh, I bet. Yeah, none of that ice can touch me. All right. Am I supposed to hit those open? Because that looked like... Okay, okay. Oh, shoot. Because they have a helmet. <laughs> well, this looks like it could be a fun platformer. I'm definitely going to dive into it some more. Uh, but uh, yeah, thanks for uh, thanks for checking that out with me. Um, like I said, I'm Ryan from the Grumpy Old Gamers. I'm just watching some uh, actual gameplay here. There's a uh, oh look at that, hey? Oh yeah, you steal that pogo. Cool. <laughs> Oh, the 90s, right? So, uh, I'm Ryan from The Grumpy Old Gamers. Uh, you can check out more of our stuff at thegrumpyoldgamers.com and uh, look us up on Facebook. A lot of activity going on there. The um, Post all of our news and everything there. And we also have a email address. You can email us at makeusgrumpy at gmail.com and that's all one word, makeusgrumpy. And uh, we'd love to hear from you. All right, everyone, have a good evening. <laughs>